This is The Product Show on Untethered.tv. You have found the Product Show on Untethered.tv. My name is Rob Woodbridge. I'm joined, as always, by Ian Klassen. Ian is sitting on a nice, sunny patio in San Francisco. Ian, thanks for doing this again. Yeah, thank you very much, Rob. Yeah, it is sunny, but uh, for us Californians, it's cold. You are so weak. Uh, not as cold. You yeah, so I'm weak. very weak. <laughs> as yeah. long as you admit that. Yeah, it's pretty bad now. <laughs> so bad. Yeah, it's pretty bad now. Well, as a former uh, Canadian, yeah, we, I'm so I, disappointed. Yeah, I, I'm sure a lot of people are too uh, up in Vancouver because uh, I just came from there and I was absolutely frozen the whole time. <laughs> so, well, you know, it's good to get your uh, bearings straight every once in a while. And, and uh, you were up there over the holidays. And a part of the holiday tradition is always uh, making your New Year's resolutions. And as you've seen, we've gone through this in many episodes to talk about the things that are important to you in order to keep yourself on par and on pace for 2015, a successful 2015. And part of that is what I try to do is become a lifelong learner. I love learning. I try to, you know, every single day, I try to learn something new, whether that's through a course, through a book, through a podcast, or through an audio book, or anything along those lines. And you have brought to us today great resources to keep your mind active and agile in 2015. So do you want to start? Do you want to kick it off? Yeah, sure. I, mean, I think one of the best resources I've ever come across for education is edX. Welcome to edX. I'm Anant Agarwal. I'm the president of edX. I'm also a professor of Electrical Engineering and Computer Science at MIT. Online learning is revolutionizing the world. Education will never be the same again, and edX is at the cutting edge of this revolution. So when you take edX courses online, you are part of this revolution. Online learning is the ultimate democratizer. When you learn on edX, you are joining a community. Imagine taking a class with 100,000 or more students. This is social, this is a lot of fun. I think you will enjoy the experience. And edX, it's about people. It's not about profit. edX is an awesome uh, site to use. It's a consortium of a number of top universities on how to deliver education to, to the masses without uh, breaking down the barriers that people traditionally have with getting uh, an education, which is finance and location and what have you. So edX is a, a great site. Now. The thing with edX, uh, they have partnered with Amazon. Um, now, you may be uh, partying at uh, New Year's Eve, and in your height, heightened drunkenness, you have come up with this fantastic app idea, and you wonder, well, hey, where do I start? Well, edX and Amazon have something for you. If you complete MIT's Entrepreneurship 101, who, which is titled, Who is Your Customer? Or Entrepreneurship 102, uh, which is titled, What Can You Do for Your Customer? You'll get $1,000 in free uh, AWS credits, uh, which is the Amazon Web Services credits for two years. Uh, you'll also get free access to AWS Essentials, which is a web-based uh, or instructor-led training. Normally, this is around $600. Um, or you can get the face one, you also get a, a month of free premium AWS business support, access to one-on-one -on -one virtual office hours, and discounts from Amazon payments. Not a bad deal. Now, the whole thing uh, about MIT, so far, get this, 25,000 companies have been started by MIT alumni that generate $2 trillion in revenue and have created 3.3 million jobs. So um, you could be one of them uh, out there in untethered land. Uh, create a new company. Um, now, <laughs> this is actually quite interesting. If MIT were a company, it would be the largest, I'd be part of the 11th largest economy in the world. Oh my God. Well, we've all known, <laughs> I mean, you know, all of the rock stars of uh, the technology community have, have emerged from MIT. Uh, it has a, many, many, many reasons, not only the reputation, the teachers, but also the way that they uh, allow research to go and find its market, which is which is incredible. But now you can be a part of it. So, I mean, if you go to edX.org, edX.org, you can find out about edX. And then, of course, you can go to edX.org forward slash AWS hyphen activate. And you can find out about this $1,000 worth of Amazon Web Services. And plus, if you are going to be an entrepreneur, these are probably essential courses that you should be taking anyways. Right. So make that a New Year's resolution to go and learn how to be an entrepreneur and learn who your customers and what they want from you. 
All right, so we go from, from that broad play. Now it's about activating the brain is your second product, isn't it? That's right, yeah. So um, another thing, too, that you can do is go to iTunes U. iTunes actually has a backlog of courses, amazing courses, all for free. Uh, of course, you cannot graduate from uh, MIT or Stanford with these, uh, with these courses, but you can get some very valuable information. Um, I've done a number of finance courses uh, through iTunes U, and um, it's fantastic. So uh, you access that through your iTunes account, all for free. That's incredible. And that's been a resource that Apple has, has put out there since basically iTunes was invented. It was supposed to be the future of education, taking the best educators and the best courses and putting them all in one spot, easily accessible from any device. So iTunes is uh, definitely a, um, they have their own app, iTunes U app, and uh, you can access it through any Apple device. All right, your third product. You were talking about uh, something called Elevate. So I see Elevate almost like mental exercises. It's like taking your brain to the gym. I'm seeing myself improve in different ways that I didn't know I could. I write a lot in my job every single day. I'm trying to make a good impression with everyone I interact with. When I'm trying to explain something to somebody and I just don't have all the words that I need, it's at the tip of your tongue, it's just out of reach. When I first started using Elevate, it was a revelation. Sometimes in the day when I'm staring at a screen, I might read something two or three times and not process it. And so, you know, even if I do a quick comprehension exercise, it makes it a little bit easier to you know, refocus myself and really pay attention to what I'm reading so I can actually do my job better. It's really easy to get into the games. It's fun, it's simple. I feel like I'm taking like a mental multivitamin. It's helped my reading. It's also helped my speaking because I'm a little bit more considered about overusing words and just being as precise as possible when I speak. I can already see it improving my everyday life when I'm communicating with people, either in person or in writing. A couple days after starting to use it, I could already see myself being better at recalling those words. In the beginning, you know, you're kind of going slow, and then as you warm up, it gets a little bit more difficult. It gets a little bit faster, a little bit harder. You can see it, the time shrinking. I like the pressure of running out of time, like right now. Ugh. I really like the scores and the rankings. I would say that I'm a competitive person. Elevate allows me to kind of better my communication personally and professionally. It really helps me work in a creative and team-oriented environment because it's improving my listening skills. I know that I'm playing a game, but I also know that I'm doing something that's good for me. At any given time, I can kind of challenge myself. And I really like that idea, using my idle time productively. Designed to improve the way you speak, write, listen, read, and more. Elevate your personal brain trainer. That's right. So Elevate uh, just won the 2014 iTunes app of the year. I use it all the time. I use it every day, actually. It gives you these little tasks to do, these little challenges to do. And the more you do them, the better you get, the harder they are, uh, the more engaged you are. Um, it's a very interesting app, well-designed, fun, fun little app to do. I think each one, each time I do it, it takes like five minutes. Um, super fun app and uh, good to get your brain going in the morning. And if you're interested in that or a little bit more information about Elevate, you can go to elevateapp.com. Exactly how it sounds. You can do a search for it on the App Store or Google Play. All right, those are three products that will help you along the way this year, 2015, in order to be able to hold down that New Year's resolution about getting yourself a little bit more brain smart. Three products from Ian. Thank you, Ian, from the sunny, sunny, sunny cafe in San Francisco. Thank you so much for doing this. We'll see you next time. Thank you, Rob. Product show. See you, Ian.